Good evening, guys. It is time for an update on the busted water pipe situation. The drywall got done today, Friday, um, four days ago, whenever Friday was. Today's Monday. Um, the plumber had come and run the pipe through the wall versus through the ceiling like it was before, so that way we don't have this issue again in the future. But the drywall's done. I'm super freaking happy right now. Um, the temperature difference in this room is way different already. You can tell with just the drywall being up, no more plastic on the ceiling, no more plastic uh, kind of going up and down every time you open and close the door. So I am so excited right now. But let's take a look and I'm going to show you how good of a job these guys did on my drywall. For any of you that have seen any of the other videos, this whole entire wall right here was taken down. So they've got that all back up, got all of this wall over here back up. It's so amazing. And then the ceiling, we've actually got a freaking ceiling right now. So I'm, I'm just happy, like, oh my gosh. The plumber had cut, let's see, he ran the pipe from right there down this wall and then it went down and this little part right here is the patch. He ran it through this pantry and then out the other side. And the uh, back wall back here is where he'd cut it out to uh, connect it to the fridge. So that is taken care of. Don't have to worry about it busting in the attic anymore. If it busts now, it'll be all at a lower level. Um, I guess that's better. I hope it doesn't bust at all ever again. But... Just wanted to take a moment and show you the amazing work that these guys did on this drywall. I cannot wait for the rest of this stuff to be completed. Um, I want the kitchen back exactly how it was with the exception of the paint color. Um, I'm still kind of deciding on my paint color. Obviously, the same one's going to be white. Um, this wall over here, there's not really, I mean, there is a lot of painting in here, but not a lot of painting. Um, this wall right here behind me, obviously, is painted. This is the previous color of the kitchen. This wall here is also painted, but this is the wall where a lot, all the cabinets, the uppers and the lowers are on, um, and the backsplash, the stove, and all of that. So, the whole entire wall doesn't get painted. And then, same thing over here on this wall where you see the window. Um, there's a lower base of cabinet, so it's just around the window and around the door. So I don't know what color I want exactly yet. I have a few samples. I thought I had decided, and I keep having second thoughts, but it's a little ways down the road. Um, I got to make up my mind pretty soon, though, so that way I can make sure that's exactly what I want. Um, I was thinking of some shade of blue. But then I also started, I love the paint in my living room. Um, and I found the paint sample the other day of my living room paint. And that's kind of what had me start second guessing myself. That maybe I want the kitchen the same color as the living room. Because I really, really like that color. But I don't know. I'll figure it out um, before the end of this week. And I will let you guys know what I decide. Women, we always change our mind. Like I think that is... Uh, like in our DNA, that's what we're supposed to do. Um, so that that's what I'm doing right now is I'm changing my mind. I'm being very indecisive. But thank you all for watching this video. And I will update you the next time something is done on this job.